Today I'm on York Peninsula in South Australia and this video is going to be focused on the campgrounds. You can book campgrounds with a permit from the York Peninsula's website and you've got 19 campgrounds to choose from. It's first come first serve when you get there. Now I'm only here for three nights so I'm going to show you a few of these campgrounds. I'm at one now and this one's pretty cool so stay tuned and I'm going to show you where we are. our campsite and we just took a risk it is summer and I think all the campsites are full up so we chose to go to Burns Beach campsite there's 30 camp spots at this beach and I had a feeling it was right next to the beach which is what we wanted because it's first come first serve at these camp spots with my van I couldn't just pull up grab a spot and and it was mine for the rest of the day so we We've parked up here I'm gonna stay here for the rest of the day it is a scorcher today so we were driving and it was 43 degrees outside it's still pretty hot right now and it's 5 p.m. Um, but we are just so thankful that we're right next to the beach so I'm not gonna talk any longer I think I'm gonna take a dip in that ocean okay I made it in the water it is not the clearest of water but from this temperature, I don't care. It just feels so nice to be in something cool. Um, I'm gonna go for a little swim and we might see you back at camp. coming back to Vladi's beach. This beach is incredible. So it's a bit of a dirt road coming up and there's a car park here that you can park in. If you've got a four wheel drive, you can drive over and park on the sand. So that is pretty cool. Now the water is so crystal clear here and it's said to have the whitest sand in South Australia. It is so stunning here. Now last time I was here, I didn't have much time to spend here and I didn't even properly go in the water so I'm making up for that now and I didn't know that I was able to fly my drone here so I've pulled it together this time and I've got my drone up in the air just for you enjoy We're at our second campsite and this one's called Port Minlakawi. Now this one is quite a big campsite, bigger than Burners Beach. I reckon you could fit up to 40 spots here. We're here today and it's pretty empty. So we got an epic spot looking over the ocean. I reckon it's gonna make a fantastic sunset tonight straight from the van. Now something I didn't tell you about the other spots was these two that we chose the last two nights have toilets. So they're pretty basic toilets. It's a drop toilet and just a tap with water so bring your own toilet paper and soap for drop toilets they're not so bad uh, but I think that this campsite is pretty epic so we're excited to spend the night at Port Minlakawi.
Last time I visited York Peninsula, I stayed at Len Barker Reserve. Now this campground is in between Burners Beach and Port Minlakawi. It has no toilets here, but it's a pretty big campsite and you've got views over the ocean. It's probably best if you're completely self-contained. It's day three and I'm at my third campsite. I'm at the Gap Campground and it's quite a big campsite. They say about 40 spots available here. Now all the campsites are little pockets, which is pretty cool. I found one that's kind of secluded. If I turn around, there's I'm staring out on a field, so uh, it's pretty cool here. Now, you can see all the campers behind me, and there's a toilet here as well, a drop toilet. So the pool to this campsite now, I don't know if you can see it right behind me through there, is a fantastic beach. It looks phenomenal from up here. I think it's called Warralty Beach. So I'm about to go head down and check it out now. four-wheel drives driving along the beach and they're going that way. Uh, I don't know, the water might be better that way. If only my van was a four-wheel drive and I can drive it along the sand, maybe next time. So I hope these few campgrounds have helped you for your next day at York Peninsula. I'm going to end my vlog here. The sun is streaming through my van here. You know I like my views. So I'm going to enjoy that sunshine and I will see you next time.